Hey, what's up everyone? This is Steven. Today I'm doing a tutorial on flash motion guides. And let's just jump right into it. So to start off, I'm going to make a action script 2, new document, and double double click on here. I'll change my background to a darker color. And we'll change the width to about 800. I'm going to zoom out so you can see this better. I'm going to make a new shape, probably on star, I guess. And we'll drag it out to about here, just so it looks like a spaceship, I guess. Let's drag it to the side. We're going to double click this layer and name it Ship. Okay. Uh, come on over to frame 60 now and click F6. Or you can right click and insert keyframe. So F6. And we will drag it. We're going to drag the ship now over to, let's bring it to here. All right. Now come back over to the first layer, right click and create motion tween. And you can see it just goes in a straight path. So now, all right, come on over to your brush tool and we'll set the brush size to something small. This is good. Let's change the color of it to a pink color just so it's easy to see. You're not going to see this in the real animation, but just for now we can see where we're drawing it. Then come over to here, right underneath your layer, select this, add motion guide. And now start from about the middle of your object, right on the circle, and let's just draw something pretty crazy out. looks nice. So now come over to your ship layer, select your move tool, and we want to make it so it snaps onto the end right there. Perfect. Now come back over to your end frame, frame 60, select it, and let it snap right onto the end there. Very nice. And then preview it. And there you go. That is uh, motion tweens. Or not motion tweens, I mean uh, motion tweens and motion guides. So there's one more thing we can do, just to be cool. Let's come up to here, make a new layer. We'll name it Actions. Come over to this frame right here. F6. Right click. Go on down to Actions. You can't see it on here, but it's there. And let's just type in a quick stop action stop just like that perfect and then click control enter again to test the movie and bam there you go you can see it stops on the last frame and that's it for this tutorial it was really simple but it's extremely useful when you're animating something so you don't have to animate every little keyframe you just do start to finish draw a motion guide and let flash do the rest of the work um, and remember, if you have anything you want me to do a tutorial on, just post it in my comment, as a comment in any one of my videos. I'll see it, and I'll get a new tutorial up as quickly as possible. And remember, you can always come on over to Pixel for Life, and on the right side, click on subscribe, type in your email, and you're subscribed, and get daily emails from us about our updated videos. So check us out. Thanks for watching.